have. Mission accomplished. <laughs>
See him roll up. You get out there and catch him. <laughs> we saw him fish. He's easy out there and stand down and let him come through your feet. <laughs> no, I'm picking up again. But do you see a fish right there? Yeah. Some fish. So, uh, this is where we came yesterday, y'all, and it's higher. It's actually higher. We just drove through there where it was all road yesterday and it's water now. Lawrence said he saw on the news where it was supposed not supposed to cross until what'd you say two a.m. Yeah. Tomorrow morning. That's that's not good. <laughs> Shucks, this is really disheartening. <laughs> where are you going, Bon? What's going on? You don't even know where you are, do you? She said, I don't remember this. <laughs> mm. She's not usually in the water. She's checking it out. strong over there. Lawrence was just saying that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. That's where all that sand was that we just got fixed. He did. Evidently, we're coming back and going fishing. People want to know how you're holding up. Mm -hmm. All you can do is laugh about it. All that is laughing is to cry. They need one. Oh, they need one. I'm going to do no good. <laughs> I don't know. Reading anything on? Nothing. <laughs> May have burnt the box up. Oh. Alright, come on. We'll, we'll unplug it. We'll go by there and see. If we... I spy a thistle. Thistles are not our friends. Thistles die. We can find them. When we find them. Used to go around all the time and get thistles. He just said he used to. We still do, we just haven't been doing it. <laughs> I need to do that evidently. I need to go around on a mule and go thistle hunting. <laughs> Bonnie's in the barley. <laughs> what are you doing, Bonnie? <laughs> Bonnie, get out of there. Come here, get out of there. <laughs> it's already a mess. <laughs> Must be cutting it off at the bottom. Sometimes he burns it. Yeah, I remember this time when I used to think I was gonna feed birds and I came home with thistle seed. That didn't go over very well either. <laughs> Sorry, little finches. Well, I reckon if you can't beat them, you just join them. So, let's see how this goes. Thank you. Lawrence just said we'll either 
catch something or we won't, but it's too wet to do anything else today. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, we'll see. Thought you were going to fish. <laughs> Have you ever fished in one of your fields before? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Have you ever called anything? Not much. Not much. <laughs> hmm. Well, basically every Memorial Day that I can remember since ever we have spent down at the Pamlico River where my mom was raised and there's always a festival in the little town Aurora North Carolina the fossil festival so uh that got canceled didn't do that this year but it kind of feels like we're at the river we we are at a river that's running through our farm <laughs> And if I close my eyes and listen to the kill deer, it sounds like, almost like seagulls. It sounds kind of like I'm back there. So, you know, what is this? Making the best of a bad situation? Yeah, that's what we're trying to do. Sometimes that's all you can do. <laughs> oh well. My feet are so white, they'd blind somebody. I gotta get some sun. I was showing how fast the water is going. Just look at him standing there. Just how fast it's moving right here. You know out there, out there in the actual river, which is all kind of one, but still, it is rolling. Dangerous place to be out there. I think we're okay right here. <laughs> It's cold too. I did step, step in it. I did, one. baby. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. It's cold. Okay, show me what you got. No. Come on. Try again. For the camera. <laughs> He's a good. Ah, uh, it's alright. Marcia said we were going to open the gate and we were going to take the mule and we were just going to go as far as we could go until she quit. <laughs> he's just kidding. Even though maybe he feels like doing it just for the heck of it. Okay, well, we didn't catch any fish because we really didn't fish, but these two played. Did you have fun? Josh, you need to get in the back. Too. Yeah. Got some tired kids, tired puppies. Well, y'all, that's Lawrence. I think he's kind of over it all. <laughs> Bless his heart. His back hurts. He's stretched out in the mule. Thinking. I can tell he's thinking. Hmm. He just keeps on keeping on. I love him for it. Good morning. Good morning, muddy heads. <laughs> Well, this is better. This is much better, hopefully. Our bottoms will look better too today then. Good. Well, yeah, probably a little mud. <laughs> we'll see. I'm sure there is. Hmm, at least the road's back open. going that way. <laughs> Let's put him, where's his head? This way. He's going this way. Put him over here a little ways. All right, buddy. Happy trails.
<laughs> Good job, Sissy. All the way across. Oh my gosh. This almost looks worse than the water. It's all mud, isn't it? Oh, my soul. Also not ideal. <laughs> Gosh. Oh. oh well. That's what we got. That's what we'll work with. Somehow. Farmer optimism. He said at least it, didn't, it doesn't look like it left a whole lot of bugs. Just a lot of mud and more sand. and sand, sand and tree sound. More fence work. I guess I was expecting to see it all back. A little bit of mud here. Oh. He said though, you can see a little bit of sorghum. Sorghum's still growing out there. Huh. Well, let's hope it continues to. And hope the rest of this water goes back in the creek shortly. This right here will never dry up. You'll never be able to get in here this uh, summer. Huh? It was already wet. Oh, yeah. We got ducks. Got ducks flying off the field. Jeez. This was going to be the hay ground that we were going to get this year. That <laughs> we still hadn't been able to get, get it wet. worked. To get it planted. Ooh. Yeah, it is a good thing. That would have been more fertilizer and seed loss. That's true. Another bright spot. <laughs> There's always a silver lining somewhere. Even if it's really thin, there is one. Showing Austin where there's some. Okay, I'm not gonna break it off, babe. Eh? <laughs> Might be the only three beans we got. <laughs> there's one. Let's see, I saw another one. There's one. <laughs> Come on, beans. I hope you're hearty. <laughs> Look at how high the water was. Is that line? That brown line? <laughs> Uh, that's over my head. Yeah. Yeah. 
Hey, buddy, look at that orange head. No, Bonnie, you can't Where have you him. Bonnie. Bonnie. Bonnie, come here. Bonnie. Let him go, let him go. <laughs> He's been in the water, man. Yeah, he has been in the mud. <laughs> no, Bonnie. You can't have him. No. <laughs> He's got red eyes, too. He's got red eyes. Well, there's some muddy sorghum. We'll see. Let's see what it does. Just really need this water to get off of here. Just come on. Go back. Go back where you came from. <laughs> Next stop, Great Creek. What do you think that is? Like this, it's like that one's just got a How ring cool on it. is that? There was one over there, and the ring was about this high. The ring on the wrong. The ring was about this high. Huh. You guys saw it laying down? <laughs> what a beautiful day at the creek. Glad to be back, aren't we? It's been a long time. Yeah. <sighs> creek therapy, that's what we'll call it. <laughs> You're right, it's always got to be something. Well, we got down here at our favorite spot, and there's a little buddy. Except it's not a good one. I'm pretty sure that's Copperhead. Yeah. Which are, where'd it go? Clara, go. Did it go in the water? Yeah, Clara, come Okay, here. That, those are poisonous. And now we don't know where it's at. Where did it go, buddy? Oh. Okay. Oh, show me. Hmm? That's a big one. Uh, they opted to come back up the creek away from that sink. <laughs> oh, well, that was our favorite spot, but we'll, we'll make do here right now. Okay, let me see your skills. Skipping skills. Well, it skipped up the <laughs> bank. Just explaining to Austin that this is a piece of petrified wood. Look at this petrified Very wood. old. You can tell us where it is. Right there. Yeah. This is really cool. That is too. That's some old wood right there. I mean, that's you know, now rock. However that works. Look, it's like so straight and very straight. It's really cool. <laughs> okay, you can keep that one. Alright, we're going to put... We're gonna put little crab crabby here in the water and see how it goes. Uh, oh, you think you found an arrowhead? Uh, okay. Come on, little crabby. Here he comes. Woo! I don't know why this is so fun. There it goes. There it goes. There it goes. Time to change some bush hog blades. I say bush. I say bush hog. Is it, it is bush hog. Uh, some people track. say it's a brush hog. It ain't a brush hog. Oh, bush hog. okay, y'all. Okay, all you. Hog. It does say bush hog. Okay, that's for the brush hog, bush hog police. This one's a bush hog. <laughs> Impact wrench. That sucker is. That's the big boy. Roll it. Little teamwork here. I've never done this before. Ah, uh, looks like a thunderstorm coming. We need some rain. <laughs> oh, 
Oh boy. I feel like Tim the Tool Man Taylor. Like I need to. <laughs> How did he do that? <laughs> Whatever. I just used this bad boy for the first time ever. Yeah. I mean, it had the end on it. But, anywho. High five. Mission accomplished. His sense of humor is absolutely horrible. <laughs> he just made me think that the bush hog was on him. And it's not. And it wasn't. And he thought that was funny. There's a blade right next to your head. I'm warning you, even though you were just mean to me. There's another one. I was just getting a lesson on air filters and carburetors. And anyway, I said some people wanted to see it crank. He said he cranked it a couple weeks ago, but I didn't see it. if I smell gas. Oh well. Now I do. Now I'm starting to smell it. Oh well. Another day. Fire How will she fire up when she didn't just fire up? <laughs> because it's done flooded now. I kept pumping it. If you crank it every few days, it'll, it'll crank. But if you set for two or three weeks, the gas drains back out or something. It won't crank. It's set for a long time, and I come out here and pump it, and it ain't crank right there. But that, that ain't the carburetor to come on. That's a four bar carburetor. I need to find me another two bar intake and put back on because it, it's aggravating. It always crank with a two bar and a four bar, it'll run. It burns less gas if you don't get in it. But hmm. Find me a two bar, which I know where one's at over on that old car. I'll take the intake and the cover it off. I have no clue what you just said, but I'm with you. Yeah. I want to ride around it. I never, I don't think I've ever ridden in it. Babe. Call it a night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Almost crank when you let off of it. <laughs> right. uh, pulling them boxes out. Say that again. What did you just say about it? The truck. I, said, I bought it brand new when we was raising the bike. It was pulling two 14 foot tandem axle trailers with the big boxes on it, weighing about 14,000 pounds. The truck weighed 5,000 pounds. I load the body up with sandbags and weight and stuff. Even put big tires with water on. So it was used as a tractor. Hmm. At 76,000 miles, it wouldn't stay in fresh gear if you held it with your foot. So I pulled the transfer case and the transmission out and no haul both of them. And I said, well, let me check the compression on the motor. So I checked and then one cylinder was always a little low. So I overhauled the motor. And then I, I painted it. Then I put all new interior in it. <laughs> and when I got on, I get $5,000 tax, tax and all for the truck brand new. I'm when I got on, I had $6,300 back in it. <laughs> <laughs> you still had wire ring in. Hmm. And so it's got how many miles? It's got 90,000 and 75 miles on it. 90,075. And it's 40, um, it's 42 years old. Yeah. 78 miles. 78, I know that math. Cause that's, that's the year I, I, got a, <laughs> I got a pickup and a wife and a combine born the same year. <laughs> and all of them run fairly decent. <laughs> I'll just leave that there, I reckon. <laughs>